girl Lee Asia. Hey, hey, hey. What's up, y'all? I'm coming to y'all with another YouTube video. Period, period, period. And um, today the video is on why did I to uh, why did I choose to attend Central State? I got this DM on Instagram from this young lady. She want me to give her a tour of the campus. I think I'm gonna come with another video for that. That's probably gonna be lit though, cause I actually want to do it when it's warmer, when everybody's on New York, cause it's lit up pure, lit like a tea. Period. Sign now, y'all. But um, let me tell y'all the reason I chose Central State. I'm wasn't I actually wasn't gonna go to school. Central State, um, they didn't have nursing, so I wasn't honestly going to come here. But I just decided, like, I just pick up a major in biology. I actually was looking to attend Tennessee State, but Tennessee State replied to me a little late. They did approve. I mean, they did accept me, but they needed my ACT score, and I had just took my ACT, and his ACT scores didn't come back yet. Central accepted me without my ACT scores. And it was a close HBCU. I actually came up here to visit with my friend. And I forgot. I think it was. I think it was one of those. One of the days where they have a big event on campus. Maybe. Maybe not. But when I came here. It was very fun. The tour was very fun. Like seeing the school. I was like. Well this ain't no big of a school. Like, basically, when you walk around this campus, it's just like a big circle. So, it's like, I ain't had no problem with them. I'm like, okay. Like, maybe I'm really considering into coming here. Um, So, I, I ended up coming to Central State. I came in with this girl that used to be my best friend. Um, Central State actually treated, treats everybody like a family. It's, it's real family-oriented. Like, I really love going here. Um... I will also say um, Central is really is really a good school. The professors are willing to work with you. They're willing to give you chances. But it's like you're grown now, so you basically have to take steps by yourself to get yourself together. You have, you have, to, be, you have to be ready to go out to school. When I first came here I'm out on, on moving day, I cried. Because I don't like being away from my mama. I was out of Cincinnati. I couldn't be with my mama every day. Like, yeah, you could call, I can call my mama every day, but still, that's not being like, that's not the same as being around my mama every day. Like, I'm her only girl, so I'm a mama's girl. Um, I just felt like I had, not necessarily that I've been thrown out to the wolves, but that I had a long responsibility being up here. Um, it wasn't really no struggle because the people were willing to help us that was already up here, that's upperclassmen. And the traditions, honestly, that we have here at Central State is, is lit. Like, when you come in as a freshman, you got Pyro Week. Pyro Week is a litty, litty thing. I remember coming in for Pyro Week 2017. That was when my mama first left. I started crying, and they had a little, they had a little thing going on that night, so I'm, speed dating was that night i'm like let me stop crying because i'm gonna go have fun or whatever so um that was actually fun it's different type of events on campus like we had a little icebreaker we had a swim party like it was lit it was really really lit i went to a cute party that first week like it was really really fun coming in but as we like as the years progress like um it's not, it's not, it was like, I'm, I'm going to keep saying this because Central State is really not a bad school. You will have troubles at every single school you go to, like, every HBCU that you attend, yeah, you have some problems with financial aid, you have problems with cash management, you have problems with all different type of people going into that type of situation, but it's fun attending Central State. Like, I love it here, I love it here, I love it here, I love my HBCU, period, like, I love it here. It's no if ands and buts about it. Yes, I'm ready to graduate because I'm ready to take myself into my field. But honestly, I really don't have no biggie on why I attended Central State because I just came here because it was the closest HBCU home to home. Like, yeah, I could have went to Tennessee State because they did have nursing, but at the time their nursing program was under investigation. But being here now, I don't regret it. Um, I actually fell off a semester. 
and now I'm graduating with my original class. I just got to take summer classes over the summer, which is no problem to me. Just when you come to college, you have to adjust the lifestyle to college. Like, it's not high school no more. You don't get away with a lot of stuff that you used to. So, it's like you have to grow up now because you're basically on your own. Even though you can call your parents when you always need something. You're basically on your own because your parents are not here to guide you to do school 24-7. They're not here to wake you up every morning and stuff like that. Like, it was really hard to adjust. Like, really, really hard. Because I'm used to wake me up every morning for school. Like, but it's just, it's fun actually being here. Like, I love it. I really, really love it. And, I don't know. At first, I feel kind of alone. <clears throat> because I ended up falling out with my best friend. So, you never, never room with your best friend coming up here. Unless y'all don't argue or, like, stuff like that. Like, you, when you living with somebody, it's totally different. Like. It's totally, totally different. Like, I don't know. It was, it was really actually like fun though. I'm not gonna, not, not gonna sit here and be like, oh, I had the worst time attending Central State because I don't. I have fun here. If anybody watch my my Snapchat stories, y'all better go add me on Snapchat. My Snapchat name is XOXO Leasia because it's lit and we have a battle with the DJs tonight. We had a Black History Month show yesterday. It was just fun. Period. Everything gets lit up here. I don't go to parties no more because I did the party in freshman year. Some parties I do be want to go to, but it's like, that's not me. I, I don't be feeling comfortable going to parties no more. Um, I like, I look, I'm going to keep saying this. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I really like going here. Like, everybody is so loving here. Like, everybody. If you, some people be like, if you don't have tough skin towards some people, then it's like, that's on you. It depends on how you take things here because everybody's just joyful. They be playing. Everybody don't take nothing to heart here. Like, mm. But I'm sensitive. I'm very sensitive. So I had to learn how to get tough skin, patch it up because, baby, they just playing with you. And that's just that. But I love you. I love you. I love it here. I love my HBC. You pal. Pal. Period. But, y'all, it be lit. Um. We got basket. We have a basketball team, a football team. We have men's and women basketball. A football team. We have a men's and women volleyball team. Um, we have cheerleaders. We have bells. We have major rats. Um, we have a band. Our band be lit, baby. If I could be a drum major, I would. <laughs> For real, no, I don't play with me. But nah, it be lit. The games be lit. So. It depends on how we plan up. But next year, we, well, not next year, but next semester, we play Howard University. What the? But honestly, I don't know. It's fun. I I just, I really have, like, if you want to, honestly, it's just something you have to experience for yourself. Everybody have a different experience coming into Central because I know I talked to some girl. And she left. She was like, Central just not for me because I just don't talk to everybody. And I'm like, that's understandable. Like, if you're just a, a person that shelter yourself and only hang with people that you only hang with and not willing to open up to other people, and maybe Central is not the school for you. Like, I just, I don't know. I like Central. I love it here. Period. Period. All right, we have, we be having Charter Day. It's always in spring semester. Charter Day. We have honors convocations, like, and Central offers so many scholarships. Is there's no way, you know, nobody should be having to pay anything. Like, it's, I'm not gonna say it's no easy school, because it's not. Especially with my major, I'm a biology major, and I struggle every single day. But I don't let that get to me because there's always someone there to help. It's always tutoring services. Your professor can help you with the, when you go to the office hours. It's upperclassmen who already took the class that are willing to help you. Like, you have to socialize with other people to, like, to make yourself feel like you're at home. You're like, I, you, you have to make yourself feel at home when you're at school. Because then you're going to want to leave. And it's no point in leaving. Like, it's lit up here. Period. But, um, I'll be dropping another video as soon as it get warm on a tour of the campus. Everybody is going to be on the yard. I got to I gotta do it during Spring Fest, though. I have to do the video during Spring Fest. So, we finna go on Spring Break. 
but I think our spring fest is in April. So as soon as spring fest hit, I'm doing a tour of the school. Period. Spring fest be lit. Homecoming is homecoming week as well be lit. We always have the food trucks. Food trucks is the best of each. I don't care what nobody. I don't be caring about the artists, baby. I care about the food trucks. Not trying to be trying to be greedy or nothing, but the food trucks become with some different type of foods. That's a different type of hit. Like, period. I love when the food trucks come. Um. That's basically it though about the school. It's many other things. Like, there's many other things to do. I'm just trying to base it off my experience because this is the things that I did. Like, yeah, I go to parties and stuff. Everybody know people go to parties. You, I go to college. A party is a party. Like, I mean, it's fun up here. Like, it's very, it's very lit. Like, right? if you do choose to come here, just look for me. Pretty, Liaja, Monet, Sagnata, Sagnata, but. Yeah, I'm about to end this video, so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on your post notifications, because I got lit content coming all 2020. What's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? All right, pretty y'all, and I'm out. Uh. I said we could never be, oh, I even tried. Don't know why we tried. I don't know why we tried.